So you want to know how to prank? Well today, Crazy Russian Hacker and I are going to show you seven zip tie pranks you can do to your friends and family. So this prank you're going to make someone think their car is broken just by using zip ties. You want to use a thick one, preferably black, but for purposes of showing you how to do it I'm using a clear one. You don't want to use the thin zip ties because they're not thick enough to make the clanking sound that you're looking for. Let me show you how to install it. So my car doesn't have a drive shaft that's under there. It's actually attached to the wheels. Okay, as you can see, I attached three of these thick zip ties to this drive shaft. So as this wheel spins, these three tails are going to be smacking against the metal components in the car, making the driver have some concern as to thinking maybe something's wrong with this vehicle. Let me show you what it looks like. So now as Eric drives by in my vehicle, listen for the clanking sound. The driver can hear it. Let's see if you can hear it. Someone's gonna think something's wrong with the vehicle. And the best part is, when they drive, it gets louder and louder, and then when they slow down, it stops. So then it makes the person think, something's wrong with my car. For this zip tie pump, we're gonna need a ceiling pen. What I'm gonna do is push it to a couple right here. And tie them up. Nice. Just like that. Now we're gonna get scissors and cut off about here. That's good. Boom. Just like that. And now when we turn off, and now when we turn on the fan, let's see what happens. They're gonna come in and it's like, oh my god, what's that noise? The fan is broken. Listen to that sound. Your mom's gonna be like, what is that? I, I mean, if I didn't know what's going on, I would freak out. My friend is my stuff, like the motor or something. It's a great prank to play on your parents. And easy. Put it on high speed. <laughs> wow. Oh, that's super annoying. For this next prank, you may want to extend your zip ties by putting two together. And sneak up on a buddy that's sleeping in class. And what the idea is, zip tie their shoelaces together. So when they get up, they trip and fall. Hey Eric, man, it's time to go, let's go. Come on. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? Dude, I didn't even, I literally didn't even feel it. Like didn't even feel it happen. So he was pretending to sleep so we could show you what it looks like. Didn't even feel it happen. And try and take a step. <laughs> try and run. Come here, come out in the hallway and run. Let me see what it looks like when you run. <laughs> Yeah, so that's a really easy one to pull on your friends that sleeps in class. For this part, we're gonna zip tie your friend's cell phone. We wanna grab a bunch of zip ties and we're gonna zip all of it out. And we got a couple hundred zip ties, so we have quite a bit of work, but it'll be funny watching them undoing it. Especially, we're gonna call them too. So they're gonna try to do it fast. Alright, and this is what your fan phone gonna look like. Now we're gonna sit on the counter and call it. <laughs> what happened? Uh, I see you're calling in there. <laughs> Pick it up, answer it. Hey, throw up. Oh, it just put my volume all the way down because of the button. <laughs> <laughs> oh my, give me the scissors, bro. Here you go, here's the scissors for you. <laughs> <laughs> no way, this is really. Oh, be careful. This is really, really tough. Nice. <laughs> 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 
he go, he got the scissors. Now let's see him struggle <laughs> with the with the cell phone. You're just gonna have to. Thank God I got this case on the back of it. I don't have to look. Ah, I should have take off the case. Oh, I'd be pissed. This is like already a task in itself. <laughs> Can you imagine what your sister would do? She, her, she found out her cell phone was zip tied. Oh my God, she's nuts. She'd cry. I guarantee you this prank will make somebody cry. Aha. Uh -huh. Ah. <laughs> Sharp. <laughs> Look at this mess, man. Man, that, that cell phone looks like a perpacata. <laughs> what? Perpacata. I don't know how you say that. <laughs> how do you say that? Perpacata. <laughs> Yoshik. Porcupine? Perpacata. <laughs> Porcupine. How do you say it again? Porcupine. Porcupine. <laughs> Porcupine. Porky pine. Porky <laughs> pine. Porky pine. Yeah. Porky pine. I got this. Dude, my phone. <laughs> Give me my phone. Yeah, I bet you broke your screen already. Freedom. <sighs> Last one. <laughs> nice. The screen's good, baby. <laughs> this is awesome. Look at that mess, man. Oh my gosh, you gotta do this prank to your girlfriend, your sister, somebody that cannot stand to be away from their friend. You do this to them, their brain's gonna explode and their eyes will water. Look, what are you talking about? What are you talking about, huh? Another obvious one is zip tie your friend's backpacks together. And it's a lot better when you do it to like 15 backpacks at once. But for an example, we're just gonna cinch it down, cut off the tail. Now when they go to open the backpack, it's unopenable. They have to go out of their way and try and figure out how to get the zip tie off. The thicker the zip tie, the more difficult and pain in the butt it is. And as a quick reminder with the zip tie pranks, it's always good to locate the scissors, maybe in class or whatever, and zip tie those ones shut too. All the scissors you can find. So then when they go get the scissors, they can't open that. What you want to do is you want to take zip ties and shorten up the slack in the telephone. So you find a phone that's got like a cord on it. What you're going to do is go through two loops here. Then towards the end, go through two more loops. And then you're gonna cinch them together. Like that. And get some scissors. Kill the tail. Boom, just like that. You can't even tell there's a zip tie. And when she goes to pick up the phone, there's no slack. All the slack's right here. The whole phone's gonna come out. And it's gonna be hilarious. Okay, on this one, you're gonna freak out somebody at their locker. You're gonna make a note that says, please come to the front desk. You're gonna post it on their locker. And you're gonna take your zip tie. You're gonna thread it through the locker. You're gonna cinch it down. Remember, more zip ties, the better. So we have two on here right now. There's no way this person can get into the locker without finding something to like help them get out. They got a note that says, come to the front desk. And then you're gonna send this person to the front desk. And they're not even expecting them. He'll be freaked out. Alright guys, let us know which one your favorite in comments below. And make sure you subscribe to Crazy Russian Hacker for some awesome science experiments and life hacks. Live inspired, shock the world, and we'll see you next time. The Sidania. This next life hack, we're taking a paper towel and a hanger. Break it in the middle so you can slide the paper towel onto it. Perfect for your outside barbecue.